Alrighty, good afternoon. Um, I wanted to update you guys on what's going on right now. I um, I followed up with my cousin again today. He actually emailed me on or texted me on his own, which is pretty good. Um, he's still looking for me a plumber, so thus far that's a no-go on the plumber. Um, electrician, same thing. Nothing has changed on that. So, But anyway, the biggest reason why I wanted to um, record this today is because I was like, Sitting up, oh my gosh, I sound like a valley girl. <laughs> oh my goodness. But anyway, um, I was sitting at my desk and just popped in my head. I completely forgot that I have two other um, parts or two other members of the management team on my job that are either contractors or involved in real estate. Completely forgot about them and that's what they do on the side. So I followed up with both of them today and I have one guy, he he was going to come out to the property today to look at it and see, you know, give his assessment of it and to kind of give me a realistic expectation. Um, I also followed up with my maintenance team of the building. They have, of course, we have a full-on maintenance department and uh, maintenance people like to hang out with maintenance people. So I was just like, hey, do you know I got an electrician that is licensed? I need por uh, permits pulled and I need things done professionally, but I need it at the cheapest cost possible. So I have them looking out for me and I'm really pulling all of my resources together to use, utilize as many as I can. Um, lastly, I wanna let you guys know, um, um, of course, you know, I got my letter from the city about a hearing and scared the shit out of me. But um, I was able to call and I spoke with a couple of people. I actually went up to the the city um, code enforcement place today and uh, everything has been squared away. Um, the only thing that they wanted to know was a realistic time frame that I'm expecting for the property to be up and running. Um, they wanted to know what were my full plans with it. And I shouldn't say full, but they wanted to know my plans and what I was going to do with it. And of course, I'm going to rehab it, rent it out. And again, they wanted to know a realistic expectation of that being completed. So. She even said herself, the lady that I spoke to, she's just like, most people are so afraid and so scared. And I'm just like, hell yeah. You know, you know, you, you tell somebody they're co they're coming in for a hearing, you I mean, you're a little upset. Or, you know, you just don't know where your mind should be. And so that's kind of what happened today. So nothing really major. Um, and I hate to say it, but I haven't started on my freaking property. I really, really hate that. So, I mean, I guess we're going to keep rolling. I'm not giving up. I um, still have money in the bank, still saving the money. I just don't have $40,000 to spend on a goddamn rehab. So I just, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep going. Uh, I'm going to keep you guys posted as this, this develops. So until next time, bye.